The Devin Haney vs. Vasily Lomachenko fight is coming up soon, and it looks like Devin Haney has some words to say about the upcoming match and his opponent. So, let's dive right in. Starting off with the fact that the fight dates have been confirmed. Bob Arum revealed that a date has been pretty well set for the long-awaited and undisputed clash between Devin Haney and Vasily Lomachenko. Haney is already preparing himself to put all four of his world titles on the line against the legendary Ukrainian, and Lomachenko will definitely be desperate to finally reclaim the belts he lost to Teofimo Lopez back in 2020. On the other hand, the talented young American captured the undisputed 135-pound title in Australia back in the summer of 2022 with a comprehensive points win over George Cambosos Jr. before finally retaining his status later that year with an equally impressive victory in a rematch. Now, finally, fans will be able to see a fight happen between Devin Haney and Vasily Lomachenko this year. I think it wasn't the best performance, but, uh, you know, I know that if me and Loma was a fight, you know, a better version would be on, on that night. But um, congratulations, and uh, hopefully we can get it on. Though there have been some problems with picking out a venue. In an interview with Boxing Scene, the Hall of Fame promoter shared that although a venue hasn't been completely finalized yet, the two elite fighters will be locking horns on the 20th of May this year. Aside from that, the fight is all agreed to and everything, but the real problem is in figuring out where they will be staging it all in the first place. For example, setting it up in New York would be a problem because of the Knicks and the Rangers, and so Madison Square Garden. Garden is holding dates for the NBA and NHL playoff games. If it can't be in New York, then Las Vegas is a good possibility. But that's not the only place it could be. There's also the option of hosting the fight in the Middle East, where they're making overtures to do the fight. There are a lot of options, to be honest. And so Bob Arum shared that it'll take 10 days for them to agree on a proper venue. Regardless, in his own words, there's no question that the fight is on. So that's definitely an amazing thing to hear. After his decision victory over Jamie Ortiz last October, Lomachenko managed to shake off nearly a whole year's worth of ring rust. And at the same time, a lot of observers felt that the 34-year-old was not at his best that night, and it's possible he had already passed his peak. Still, Loma is thought as one of the most gifted boxers of his generation, and will definitely be one of Haney's toughest matches in his entire career up to date. But Haney is pretty confident about the match. The undisputed lightweight Devin the Dream Haney has climbed the ranks a lot in the past couple of years, going from the email champion all the way to the king of the division. And now that it's been confirmed that he'll be defending his undisputed crown against none other than Vasily Hitek Lomachenko, Haney is more than ready to show off that he's not afraid of anyone. Now, even though Hitek struggled a little bit in the early portion of his fight against Ortiz, the reality is that he's still considered a pretty high-level fighter. But the Dream isn't having any second thoughts about his upcoming match. In fact, in an interview on The Boxing Voice, this exact topic was brought up, that Lomachenko might be a bit of a threat to Haney's crown, considering that Bob Arum called him a master boxer. But the Dream had just the answer for that. In his own words, he may be a master boxer to Bob, but he's not no master to me. No matter how good Lomachenko might be, Hanny knows that at the end of the day, they're both fighters and they're both human. They're both one and the same thing. And so when the time comes that they'll go face to face, Hanny will be going in with one thought on his mind. I will show he ain't no master. You got promoted Bob Arum saying that he's a master of some sort. I think uh, you got to Obviously, he thinks highly of him. I'm sure you don't think that's the case. He might be a master to Bob, but he's not a master to me. Uh, and at the end of the day, it, it is what it is. You know, he's he a fighter just like me. He's human just like me. Uh, you know, he, he, I will show that he, that, he, that he ain't no master. Interestingly, they have come face to face before, just not for a fight. After the Ukrainian's most recent win against Jermaine Ortiz in New York at the Madison Square Garden, Devin Haney and Lomachenko squared off in the middle of the ring almost immediately. Their huge size difference was very noticeable. Lomachenko even joked, Is this a lightweight? No, it's a heavyweight. But Haney was quick to reply with a quip of his own, In the ring, I'll show you. It's lightweight? Is this lightweight? <laughs> He's it's a big lightweight. Huh? No, it's heavyweight. <laughs> now, in the ring, I'll show you. Okay, okay. I will be, I will be ready. 
Later on in an interview, Haney shared that Lomachenko was a lot smaller than he originally thought the Ukrainian would be, especially considering that a lot of people say that he's not even a real lightweight. He's a smaller guy. In his opinion, the lightweight division is not really his class, but at the same time, Lomachenko's been winning at the weight for years now, so you can't really say that. Yeah, um, he was definitely a, uh, a lot smaller than what, what I thought he was. Um, but they, a lot of people say he's not a real, he's not a real light. I mean, he's not a real lightweight. Uh, he's a, he is a smaller guy. But the, the lightweight division is not really his class. Right. Anyway. Anyways, the two are pretty similar height-wise, at least. Where Haney stands at five foot eight inches, while Lomachenko is just an inch shorter, according to their box rec profiles. At the same time, the side-by-side -side comparison on the screen appears to favor Haney even more. Devin the Dream Haney also went on to say that the Ukrainian's matrix-like moves don't really bother him at all. But is Haney right to be so confident about the match? That is, who is more likely to win in a fight between Devin Haney? and Vasily Lomachenko. Okay, to be honest, this matchup is a bit of a tough call. And yes, it's mainly because of their huge size difference, but it's also because of the difference in their styles. That is, there aren't that many fights out there that have seen someone with Loma style face off against someone with both Hanny style and size. So there's not much to even compare this upcoming fight to in the first place. Fans have been long debating who would possibly win ever since the fight was brought up in the first place. And it looks like most of them think Haney is the one more likely to defend his title successfully. And to be honest, it makes a lot of sense. He has the style advantage after all, given his height and reach, but it also depends a lot on how he adjusts to Lomachenko's own speed and angles. On the other hand, a lot of fans argue that styles make up fights, and in that department, Loma's a clear winner. And he'd run circles around Devin Haney. He also arguably has a really good style for dealing with the dreams defense, angles, and stuff aside, he's pretty good at cutting the ring. He's also been showing off some good infighting skills in his past two fights. Either way, no matter who ends up winning or who may or may not have the advantage, one thing is definitely clear. This is going to be a tough fight for Haney. He might even have to be the one figuring Loma out. Where will fans be able to watch the fight? Considering the big purses that both Haney and the former three-division world champion Lomachenko will be getting for the match, it makes a lot of sense for Top Rank to put the fight on ESPN pay-per-view, but it hasn't been confirmed yet. It looks like it's still questionable whether there'll be enough hype from boxing fans in purchasing the event to cover the purses. But here's my question for you. Who do you think would win in a fight between Devin Haney and Vasily Lomachenko?